Hello! Following the last video of Chonsa Bridge and Moan Book Bridge in Xinan in Korea, I'll show you Papo Islands, Pakjido and Panoldo, and Papo Foot Bridge to reach them. The Papo Foot Bridge is the way to villages of islands, while Moan Book Bridge in the last video is to desert islands. Because of Chansa Bridge, the islands of Bakjido and Panoldo can be traveled on foot in 4 or 6 hours. First, I took a video of the Papo Foot Bridge under it, and it is pretty long. It is a marine Papo wooden foot bridge connecting Bakjido Island and Panoldo Island. A lot of Jangtunga fish, Gobo eyed Gobai, were jumping into water. They were similar to lizard, and I was excited to see them for the first time. It said the admission fee for adults was 3,000 won at the ticket office, but was free for a while. For a tip, it is free if you wear something and pop up. Wow, this is better than I expected. You can see from any angle, being connected to any directions of the east, west, south, and north. I longed for walking across a bridge to get to islands. Now it's possible, besides it attracts many tourists, having been built nicely and beautiful purple. I imagine they had chosen Popo for honoring Pang Tan, the world's most popular idol day. I reached Bakji Island and there was a sculpture of a gold, which represents the former name of the island, Bagi Island, meaning the island's shape of a gold. Before crossing the bridge to Panoldo Island, I decided to walk around Pakjido Island to view the Garden of Lavender and have lunch. I was going to the restaurant. I could take a small bus with a fee of 1,000 won, but decided to walk. After walking around the island, I'll come back here and cross this purple bridge to Panoldo Island. Roofs and road are purple too. The towering island across is Panoldo Island and it looks great. A small pretty island is seen too. The approaching small village bus is pretty purple too. Plastic covering soil is purple too. The store without a cashier that customers buy stuff and pay on their own. A small hotel that villagers run together. After walking of 20 minutes, the restaurant appeared. Popo cups and dishes. This is the only one small restaurant in this village. And where do so many tourists have meals on the busy weekend? As this is the only restaurant, I wanted to surely try on food here. Kimchi stew is served in a big hot earthen pot. It's good. They seem to use well-aged kimchi.
for watching. Please subscribe, like and comment.